Hold on, I think I see something in here. Oh. I see something. Treasure. Yep, it's Lotso from Toy Story. <laughs> and let's see. Normally Lotso, he smells like um, strawberry. You like this one too? <laughs> Ugh, this one doesn't smell. I don't know if this is one of the ones that smell her. Alright, we're back to load another unit. We're out at um, public storage. Won this unit online. Paid $710 for it. So we're about to crack the door open. Actually, you know what? I didn't pull up far enough. I just did the lock. There's a lock on that one. I was thinking of that. One. We gotta pull up. All right, hold on just a minute. I'm gonna pull up about ten more feet. Did I pull up far enough? Okay. The lady at the storage facility just gave us that lawnmower there. She said it was abandoned on property. Automatic, automatic door. Okay. Yep, I saw this in the um, in the picture. There's. Alive in there. It looks like they. I mean, they. Looks like a plug running somewhere. There might be something in there. Let me step back and show the whole unit. But you can see, there's the fridge. I can see that one that's bidding, and the ladder, and the ramp, and the aquarium. There's a bunch of them. One, two, three. I can only I saw that one in the pictures, but I didn't see these when I was bidding. We got like paint maybe. I don't know. I saw these cases. I don't know if there's stuff in them or not. But even just the cases by themselves like are worth money. Advanced automotive lighting system. I think it's just automotive type stuff. I don't know if it's... Uh, that one's got, got sockets, Allen wrench, other odds and ends. What is that stuff? Ooh, LED light bulbs. LED bulbs, some more hardware. That's like um, receptacles. There's some clamps in there. So they're all full of stuff. But we got this big extension lighter here. We got this ramp. This is like off of a truck, like from a, a U-Haul style ramp. And we got one, two, three backpack blowers. That's a uh, still, whether any of these work or not, I don't know. Oh, look at this. I didn't even see all the, I saw the boat, but it's got all the RC car stuff in here. Look at that skateboard. Oh, yeah. Some of these are worth a little bit of money. Yeah. See, sill sports? I don't know. Control cars, remote control boat, that. remote control helicopter, oh, and that on. red basket over there. The, the rug, the rug looks decent. Oh, wait a minute, Keith. Look, wrapping paper, brand new wrapping oh, paper. Right, you didn't score. even notice that. What's that? Grow bigger, healthier plants. Oh, it's a grow, uh, it's grow a grow light. light. But I think let's see. That feels like it's in there. Yep. Looks like it's look, look like it's new. That goes to uh, this weed eater. It looks um, like. Yeah, that's not doing that. Some screws. I'm trying to see what's. Oh, wait a minute. Let me move this. Let's see if you can take that without it going over, so we can see what's down. Uh, look at this. Got a whole Pittsburgh whole plier set. Brand new. There's an AC Delco starter. 
maybe. I mean, it's it's heavy. It's Real definitely light. definitely something in there. We got some furniture sliders, trap and toss, oh, fly trap. Fly trap. Right here, we got a case. See what's in this thing? That's heavy. Here's another one. It's heavy. Here's another one. Sandpaper. Okay. Yep. Oh, this T-handle hex key set, and portable refractometer, but feels empty. And yeah, there's nothing in there. Dremel, but it's like the Craftsman version, or is it a yeah, yep, Craftsman version of a Dremel tool there. Alright, so let's go back in there. Let's take a look at what we got. Uh, looking at that basket right there is a helicopter. That red basket. Little RC helicopter. Ooh. We got the RC helicopter, but several like bodies, motors, stuff. We got the big boat here. There's another car up under the boat. Several. That's kind of on top of it. Let's see. That's empty. in there it's just like what is this? Kind of aquamax aquarium filter that might be hmm. that, that might be worth some money well they got the big daddy aquarium here so and I guess this maybe this is chemical with the stuff for the aquarium reef fusion mm -hmm. that's not much in there Okay, we got a little shop stool here. That's cool. Oh, twine. Everybody can use a little twine in their lives. And looks like this is aquarium stuff right here. And then what is this? Aquarium stuff, maybe? Here's a Milwaukee charger. Submersible pump. A Milwaukee charger. There's some aquarium, it's kind of a mix of aquarium yeah. and then like tools and repair type stuff. But this fridge looks really nice. Yeah, look, at, cool. look at the handles on this fridge. I just now noticed this. You reach in. I haven't even seen that. I haven't seen this before even at the store. Mm -hmm. This model. Where, yeah, but you reach in there instead of actually having the handle yeah. that sticks out. Samsung looks in great condition. So hopefully mm -hmm. that's the case when we open it up. Keith, there's something alive in here. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> no, I think it had it was fish in there. It wasn't a snake or nothing. So. Oh, that's a file cabinet. But were they using it as a file cabinet? Sometimes people use these files as. Yeah, there's not. There's tools in there. Right on. Cool. Who wants a bunch of files anyway? Right there, that thing is weird. It's about falling over. Yeah. Oh, what I actually do? Uh. I brought a knife today. <laughs> <laughs> I'm and I didn't use it just then. Oh, that's cool. That's way better than files. Air hose, staplers, all kinds of stuff in here. Whole set of nuts and everything. We got, we got controllers, square, the glue gun, this little pry thing here, all kinds of stuff. Oil filter. Let's dig down in there. There's wrenches, yeah, sledgehammer. I mean, it's got stuff all down in here. Pliers, we got channel locks. We got little electrical caps there. Oh, look at that bad boy. Don't you wish it was just files though, like you said? Yeah. There's a little spotlight. Another spotlight. Another hand. Oh, maybe that's the same sledgehammer that we. Right 
waiting to see what's in the next one. I don't know if we can. We got this is like more aquarium stuff. What is this right here? Huh? I don't know what that is. Scrap metal. Yeah. <laughs> and more cool types of hardware. There's all kinds of stuff. Look at it. Is that in there? It's pretty light, but. Um, yeah, there are two of them in here, actually. Well, this one, okay. So it's... It's a set of them. And each box, I guess, right? Are there two in there? So is it just the... Just, oh, headlight. The I'm thinking of the one you put on your head. <laughs> That's what I'm like, this don't look right. That's what, That was my thought, so I was like, this isn't the... Right. It's a headlight for a car. Hey, look at this. Look what you got a brother for. There you go. No, you got a white and blue one just like I do. Here's a, oh, a little X-Acto knife yeah, set. Oh, look at that. Got all the blades, everything. It's empty. Viking. But some of that stuff that's empty could be loose in here. Here's another headlight, I guess. Autofill. It's a little extractor. Drill bit set. And then we got things, uh, the extractor set. Tack cloth. Lighter. More lights. There's something in a box. Right there. Oh, the faucet. faucet. It might be in there. Turbo LED V16. Hmm. Clip this. Right Look at all those little clips. Dang. All right. So, so far, so good. There's a um, little drawer thingy. What's it got in it? It's more of the same kind of miscellaneous, it looks like. I don't see no household crap in this unit, you know? Uh -uh. This is all good. <laughs> Not that That's like, okay, they got like, there's a bunch of pumps in there, probably aquarium stuff. Um, yep, that's aquarium, reef builder. So that's gonna be all aquarium type stuff in there. Fish stuff, yep. So if we come back here, what is that? Is that an aerator? The red thing? Yeah. Was that, was the, was that case right there empty? Yes, it's only a handle. That's on. empty. We got a shelf that's kind of collapsing back here. This might be like a big torque wrench or something here. In this yeah, case. Are right. oh, you opening it up? No, I haven't, but I can just tell it. One of them is like a small pound, and the bigger one is like a foot. It's an inner. This is an inner tie rod removal set. Uh, you know? Oh, is it? Yep. Yeah, because it's got that big, yeah, that big the, wide wheel on the front. Does it have the spikes on the back? Yes, and for the holes. The yeah, that big wide right. wheel because you got to go through the um, dirt and stuff without it getting digging down in it. All right, so we got we have an aerator here. Honest, this aerator this may pay for the whole unit. I mean, there's a, there's several there's several big ticket items between this big aquarium right here, the fridge. I mean, there's lots of big ticket items in here. I wonder what this is back here. Okay, well, truck bed cover. A light. Something really. Oh, I wonder if it's like an aquarium bulb, maybe. Purple, yeah, because it's got, yep, it's got coral in there. Those are aquarium bulbs. I wonder if that's a salt aquarium. Maybe. Well, it's got like coral, and I bet it is because it has like little coral and stuff in the bottom. Okay, there's another, there's a toolbox back here. Ooh, yes. And there are all these, what is this? Chemical guys? 
<laughs> it looks like a frisbee, but I mean, what? Chemical guard. Oh, it's a bucket lid cap. Okay. And then we have an odd item here. Look, a pair of women's shoes. That is very odd. They're like not brand new, but here's a van. We have a Vans box. Here's a pair of Vans. Yes. They're in pretty decent shape. They're, they're a little dirty around the edge, but they're not. They're definitely sellable for a few bucks. Stinky ones? Yeah, it's dumb. Here's the, here's Ken's room. Uh oh, we might have a PlayStation 4 down there. We we'll get a PS4 game and the controller. Here, these Ammo boxes. Ammo boxes? <laughs> oh my. Goodness. Oh, look at this. This is crazy. Hold on, Keith. Look, we got all these. Uh, Old flip flops and junk, and then down underneath them. Here, where's my knife? Let's go. So we can open this better. Is that heavy? Yeah. It looks heavy. Yeah. Here, open that. And... There's an ammo box, and there's more hidden down underneath this. One more ammo box. And then there's something. What is this? Taurus. Taurus? That's, that's a gun box, but it don't feel like. It's in there. We got here. ammo in yeah, here, though. The size of those bullets. This was for a uh, four ten. We got one. Looks like a forty five. One bullet in there. Yeah, it's forty five. Yep, forty five. Colt forty five. Man, that'd be nice if that was in these uh, we'll ammo have to bugs. check in here. You never know. It could. Usually not. Usually the guns yeah, aren't aren't in here, but you'll find the ammo and clips and everything. Good. Let's, this thing might be full of 45 though. AR-15 micro tool. Yeah, this thing is full of ammo. That's oh, this is a knife right here. Elk Ridge ballistic. It's like brand new. And we got. M193. That's brand new, hadn't been opened. 410, 410 gauge. And this whole thing is just full. 410 gauge. 40. 40 caliber. And it goes all the way down. Just all these are, and all of them are pretty much all the way full. This one right here has been open, and a few of them are out. Two twenty three Remington full metal jacket. So that thing's completely full. Here's another. I think this is a knife. Kershaw. Oh yeah. Good enough. Seems like it's getting dark in here. Wait, there's a bulb. This one looks like. Oh, that's nice. That's in good shape. Hold on, then we'll look in that other one there you got. This is definitely a man's unit right here. Yeah, I like this. Ann wouldn't have had no fun with you. Here. Yeah. Like, this is it? Where are all the pennies and decor and stuff? Now I gotta try to figure out how to get this back in here. At least close to back in here. We got another one, and these were all in that box Stinky right shoe there, box. underneath the shoes. Drum roll. And this thing, holy crap, holy crap. A bag of bullets. It's like 20, 22 long, I reckon? Uh, no, no, no. Enough about bullets. It was kind of bright in here, and then the sun kind of went. Got a 
97 on it. Okay. We got 410. What's that Intec on top? Is that a knife? It's a knife, I believe. Oh, this is cool. Ooh, this thing's like a tactical knife. Intec hmm. Ballistic. All right, I know I already showed this before when we found it in the unit, um, the two ammo cans full of ammo, but I'm going to give another view now that i got it all pulled out here and this brighter lighting so just so you can get a better idea. But it was these two ammo cans that we found in the box underneath all the old shoes. But all of this, um, this is all going to be the 5.56. All three, of, all these are full of that. That's one that's open. All that's the 5.56. Then we have all that. Um, we got a couple magazines or clips. We got the AR-15 tool. We've got some 45. These are the two that, uh, these two and that one are, are open. The rest of these are all full and brand new. But 9 millimeter, 223. We got some 410, 410 caliber here. 410 gauge, sorry, on these right here. We got more of the 5.56, which is the same as over there. All this is 5.56. Um, that's 45. We end up with three of these AR M4 um, magazines here. And then we ended up with these knives, M Tech Ballistic. That one there, that one there. Elk Ridge Ballistic. And then a Kershaw knife. So pretty good little score here from those two ammo cans plus the ammo cans themselves are valuable so pretty good little ammo score yep the toolbox has the keys in it yeah. yep it's key here key there. it's a craftsman i wonder if this was to sit on that big box right there that looks like a file cabinet Drawer liner. I don't like they ever put anything in this top drawer. Literally, there's, the the there's, there's, there's not like a speck of dirt in there. Yep. Um, well, no, I think that's like, yeah, it's flat. That's like a middle one. So, nothing much in there. We got spark plugs, some pliers. More odds and ends. Oh, here we go. A whole s bunch of sockets. No, Quinn. You ever heard of Quinn? <laughs> There's some Quinn sockets. We got a bunch of paperwork. There's the file. This is, yeah, this is his file box. Here's a Milwaukee tool flashlight. It's magnetic, isn't it? Yeah, it's got a bunch of craftsman craftsman wrenches, more sockets, Pittsburgh wrench. Find anything good over there? No. <laughs> And here we've got more miscellaneous tools. And these tools are going to add up. Here's another big old flashlight. That one doesn't come on. Car diagnostic tool. A little scanner. More sockets. And down here, more miscellaneous tools there's a GFCI outlet those are expensive a little level so that thing is full of tools this must have been her dresser that was her dresser okay. the little plastic organizer radar detector. Here's some old bullets. a little more ammo 
Not much. But. Well, here's some clips too from uh, magazine. AR M4 rifle magazine. There's another one. And another one. Maybe we'll have all the pieces to build one. Lift this lift this wheel up and see if it's are we do we have all matching ones? Crazy. Most likely. Pirellis. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, it's all some kind of matching set of wheels here. Heavy. Pirellis? Yeah. Oh yeah. And they've got I think that they'll fit on anything, really, because look at the lug nut pattern. Yeah. Hmm. I wonder what this is right here. Check that container right there. Wire, Wire City. Good lord. Mm -hmm. We got some can lights here. I like this thing. Big LEDs. We got this wooden box right here. I wonder what's in here. It's heavy. I think it's a fan. I'm going to take two computers. I think a little more light. I'm gonna open it from the wrong side. Oh, it's a, it's a humidor and it's full of cigars. Really? Yeah. There's a bunch of cigars in here. I don't know if there's anything worth anything. There's a key in here. That might go to something. Yeah, I don't know anything about cigars. You don't know about them? No. Monte Cristo? I mean. I wouldn't know if any of these are worth anything or not. Handmade. Like oh, yeah. Nassau, Bahamas. Yeah, you can look them up. But right off hand, I don't know nothing. I know if they're green, they're worth a little bit more. Tobacco, Maribel. Vintage Reserve La. Paloma. Yeah, there's a bunch of cigars in there. This flashlight's going crazy. So we get the humidor. We get this big old grill. That's what this is right here. It's a huge grill. Smoker. Yeah, it's got the smoker box over here on the side. Stay open. <laughs> Golly. This is like the girl box, it looks like. We got some decorative letters. We got this contraption here. More decorative letters. Yeah, it's like a... And then we got one of these fancy mirrors down here. It's just like a little... You and I are sisters. All right, we're trying to get all the water out of this aquarium because probably who knows how much in weight and water, so heat just siphoned with this tube right here, and we got it pulling out because there's about five, maybe six inches of water in this thing, adding to the weight, which is already gonna be heavy because this is glass. You've got coral in there. It looks like there might be sand all in the bottom of this thing. The whole cabinet itself and everything that's under there. All right, I'm looking at this aquarium here. When you look, there's some kind of hair in there. I wonder if there's an. <laughs> Is there a dead animal in here? I've got to look in here. <laughs> Is that? Okay, I think it's a jacket with a with a fur like a fur hood or something I thought there was gonna be a, I thought there was a dead raccoon or a cat in there see that right there but I think it's just a jacket this was thrown over in there all right we just pulled all this RC stuff out of there there is a few more miscellaneous pieces I think some remotes and stuff's on there but we got this big boat here. We got this other boat. That boat there is about three foot long, that big one there. This looks like some sort of a drone. 
they made or were building or something. Helicopter. Then you got all these RC cars here. And then you got this bad boy right here. Gas powered. RC car here. That's pretty cool right there. Yeah, and there did end up being a rigid tile saw there. Alright, we just rolled this aerator out. Kind of not getting the best service here, so I was having a hard time looking up to kind of get a price, but I did pull up a, a similar model. $2,900, or $2,999, basically $3,000 what it was selling for. Right, we found the box with, we got two PS2s here. Remote, this is for a helicopter, I don't know if that's for that one or not. And another remote for something. Not really sure exactly what. We've got some kind of Scarface box down here. Let's see what we got. It's the um, it's like collector's DVD edition. We got the big boy Brinkman charcoal grill with smoker box. We got a little bag here. We got some almost brand new. Looking New Balance tennis shoes here. And looks like some just some regular old girl shoes. Hold on. Might have some. We got some Converse All Stars here. And there's lots of clothes and stuff in there. Alright, we're pretty much done here. We're just down to the nitty gritty. Pretty much no surprises left here. We pretty much know <clears throat> whatever's left right here. Um, turned out to be a really good unit. Paid $710 for it. The fridge alone in there should get around that money back. It's a very, very nice fridge. Big Samsung stainless steel French door. Um, then we've got the toolboxes. We've got the aerator. We've got the two aquariums, all the aquarium supplies. We've got the um, big smoker grill and lots of um, tools, tons of hand tools and everything like that. We've got these two ammo boxes slammed full of ammo ladder ramp um i'm probably missing stuff we got blowers three backpack blowers to mess with all the rc stuff right here so overall very good unit like i said one or two items should pay for the unit everything else you know will put us in the profit and pay for some of pay for our expenses but it was a man's unit a few odd thing mixed in mixed in but they were into aquariums they were into guns they were into tools um what else were they into I don't aquariums. know. Aquariums. Aquari <laughs> I, already, I think I already said aquariums. Oh, and they were into RC cars. Yeah. So they had a, a lot of expensive hobbies and expensive habits, which is going to turn out good when you start to resell that stuff. But um, So pretty cool unit. Lots of cool surprises. The ammo was a really cool surprise underneath the stinky shoes. You just never know what you're going to find. It had been really cool if we would have found some of the guns. I mean, he had all kinds of ammo. There's, he must have had a whole arsenal of guns because he had all different sizes of ammo. But... Like most of the time, none of the guns were in there. The, the, there were a couple of the actual boxes that came in. Lots of the ammo, lots of the clips, but no guns. But that's pretty normal um, as far as what you're going to find. But overall, really good unit. We're almost done here. Going to wrap this one up, but we'll be buying more units. And like I said, I still have that really, really, really good unit that I'm working on the video. It'll be coming out now any day now, so keep a lookout for that one. Hit the like button on this one. Um, subscribe if you haven't already. Leave us a comment. Ask us a question. Tell us about something here that we didn't know what it was or we're calling it the wrong thing. Just let us know. I don't, you know, it ain't going to hurt my feelings. And y'all have a good one.